this video, we will be discussing managing users in the Sage Time Slips Anywhere. The user portal is used by the Sage Time Slips Anywhere administrator to add and invite users. You can also remove a user or edit their information and re-invite them service. When the product is purchased, a product activation email will be sent to the user whose email address was given to the salesperson. And the email address will look something like this. So the email will be titled activate your service. And you will have an option there to get started. The Sage ID that is shown there is the email address that was supplied as the main user. Clicking on get started will take you to the product and attempt to log in. TimeSips Anywhere uses Sage ID, which you can have for another product with Sage. If you do, you would just enter in your email address associated with that Sage ID and your password. If not, you will be prompted to create a Sage ID. This particular account does have a Sage ID already created, so we will go ahead and log in and the product will activate as it processes the new user and then a prompt to continue from there. Focusing on the management of the users, we'll go back to our email. So the email that will come to you after your product is activated will have this information. You'll have a link both to Sage Time Sips Anywhere and a link to the user management console. Once you click on the user management console, you will see the information provided. This particular account has five licenses, of which two have already been invited, and three are available. So we're going to invite a new user to join the TimeSips Anywhere account. Click on Create User, and we'll be prompted for that information. So we have an Outlook account set up currently, titled STA 2023 Demo at Outlook.com. Back to our User Management Console, fill in that information. We give it their name. We can create them as only a TimeSips Anywhere user or a TimeSips Anywhere user with access to the user management. For now, we're just going to create a user with just the ability to access the TimeSips Anywhere application. Once we save that information, we will see them in the portal here. And here they are. So now we send the invitation email to them by clicking Invite. It tells us that we're inviting. And they've been invited. So now we'll go to the email. And there's our email. Here is the acceptance email. And again, we're going to click on the Time Sips Anywhere Accept Invitation. This user does not have a Sage ID. Here is where we create a Sage ID. In order to do so, we will click on Create Account. It's going to ask us for our information. And we will click Sign Up. At this point, we get a email back to our inbox, which gives us a six digit code we have to put in for verification. And this logs us into the TimeSips Anywhere application. So once we're logged into the application, we'll have the option to do the different functions that are here. This is a wizard that allows us to create a new setup for our clients, to create our clients, et cetera, throughout. In the user management console and the user portal, we have the ability to edit different accounts, to change their rights, to change their name, et cetera. And as you notice, the email address must match the email address used for Sage ID. That's indicated there. And we can also remove accounts if we choose to take someone out of Sage Time Sips Anywhere. Just by clicking the buttons, following the wizard. And now our license count has changed where we have five users, only two invited and three available. We can once again create users and create new timekeepers and users in Time Sips Anywhere from that screen. Inside of Time Sips Anywhere itself, we do have some ability to 
manage timekeepers, but primarily the only functionality of it is to change the timekeeper nicknames, the full name, the email address, and their hourly rates on each individual user from the Time Slips Anywhere application itself. Everything else is managed through Time Slips Anywhere user management. Congratulations. Now you know how to manage users in Sage Time Slips Anywhere.